Hi folks, it's Mike Murphy, and today's quick tip is an Adobe After Effects CC 2020. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use the loop out cycle expression, which creates a continuous loop between the first and the last keyframe of your animation. First, I'm going to select the logo layer. I'm going to drag the playhead or the current time indicator all the way to the beginning. I'm going to tap on R to bring up the rotation property. I'm going to click on the stopwatch to create a keyframe. Then I'm going to drag the playhead out to the two second mark. And we want this to rotate 360 degrees. Now you could move this up to 360 degrees, or you can just tap in here and type in one. That means it'll rotate 360 degrees one time. I'm just going to click off of it. I'll move the playhead back, tap on the space bar. And now we've got the logo rotating once. And now we're going to add the loop out cycle expression. So it will rotate over and over again. To add an expression in Adobe After Effects, you're going to hold the Option key on a Mac, Alt on a PC, and click on the stopwatch for the property that you want to add the expression to. So in this case, we're going to be adding the loop out expression to the rotation property. So I have the Option key pressed. I'm going to click on the stopwatch. So I'm going to type out lowercase l, OOP, capital O, U, T, parentheses. Now this is all we need for the loop out cycle. Even though cycle is available, you could type it out. For loop out cycle, you do not have to type anything in the parentheses. You can just leave it just like that. Click off. I'm going to bring the playhead back to the beginning. Tap on the space bar to preview. And now we have an endless loop of this animation. And if you ever needed to adjust the speed, you'll just use the keyframes. If I wanted to slow it down, I would just space out the keyframes and that will not affect the expression at all. If you ever need to edit or modify your expression, you can just twirl down the property and you'll see the rotation. You can just click in there to edit. If you ever want to delete an expression, hold the Option key on a Mac, Alt on a PC, and just click on the stopwatch and that will remove the expression. So we'll do one more example, but this time we'll add the loop out cycle expression. Bring this back to the position the space property. Bar, you can see I'm the tap bus. on P for position. You're just going to click go on the one end to the other. That's going to create a keyframe. I'll drag the bus out here to the middle. So I'm going to bring this to the four second mark, and I'm just going to drag this off. You'll see the bus goes from the left side, it goes all the way to the right side, and then stops. If we want to continuously loop, we're going to hold the Option key on a Mac, Alt on a PC, and click on the stopwatch for position. Lowercase l, OOP, capital O, U, T, parentheses. Remember, we do not have to type out cycle. You can if you want, but the default for loop out is the cycle, so we can just leave it blank. Click off, hit the space bar, and now the animation will continuously loop for the duration of the composition. My name is Mike Murphy, and that is how you use the loop out cycle expression in Adobe After Effects CC 2020. Cheers.